Pat. What am I doing? What am I doing? I forgot what I'm supposed to do. Uh, go to the ba main bathroom and dive into the pass. Can I go in here first? Look, it's so amazing outside. Push. Push. Nothing sticks out to me. That sticks out to me. <clears throat> to the main bathroom. This is the main bathroom. Teddy. Thanks for all the help. Ah, no problem, David. We're partners. You may have quit the force, but that fact won't change. Well, if you trace it all the way back, if I hadn't asked you to join up in the first place... Teddy! Nada. Don't give me that look, Amanda. I'm just trying to give him a reason to live. Meow. Teddy. Little Peggy. Here we go! Time has been frozen for me since that day. <laughs> Will I see you this time? <laughs> Bring it! And that's the end of Prologue 1. Well, not Prologue 1, just Prologue. D4. Oh! Uh, next episode. Episode 1. David. <laughs> this is a story of a man with a very strange fate. Very strange. Look, it's like I've grown wings. Where did I quantum leap this time? The lavatory. On an airplane. Another successful dive. Touching memories called mementos. Allows me to dive into the past. The day little Peggy was killed, I survived. Miraculously, somehow, I survived. In exchange for losing my memory, I gained this power. That 
has to be a sign of something. This is all very unnecessary, but okay. Past will surely tell me the truth. Look for D. There's four D's behind you, but okay. And there's four D's right here. I can't get a voice out of my head. Who killed her? Just who is D? The only way to silence that voice is to change my fate. Back, back. Back to the pass. Who is D? Who is D? Killer? Wait a second. Conspirator? Mastermind? Never mind. Oh, Those are just four backwards deeds. D's. Not clearly nothing. Clearly not what I'm looking for. Heck yeah! D. Vanishing from an airplane during a flight? That's impossible. There's got to be something I'm missing. Like you've just seen a ghost. My apologies, Olivia. You just look so much like an old girlfriend of mine. What's that supposed to mean? Just for a second. I actually thought little Peggy had come back to life. to get back to work sure no problem Olivia no oh, Olivia Just I don't know why I say thing, Oliver sir. you're surely aware that we carry a passenger list aboard huh memorized it have you we don't take kindly to stowaways if that's what you are a stowaway am I well miss Olivia Jones Maybe you're on to me. Ha. <laughs> I'm just gonna grab I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna go jump myself. No. Nope. The courier is gonna vanish, is he? Thick clouds looks no like Teddy. Trick he uses, I'll get to the bottom of this. Wait, why does that why does that look like Teddy, but okay. Ooh, hello. I got me food. I love to pat everyone I see ten thousand times. Watch where you're going. Oh, go and grab that. Hello. Pat again. Is anything the matter? You mentioned the passenger list. 
Oh, I'm sure it's just my mistake. You really do have it memorized? I thought I did, but I'm still new at this job. It's probably just my mistake. I'm sorry I said anything. Stowaway. You called me a stowaway, didn't you? My apologies for that, sir. What did you mean? Nothing really. No deep meaning. Nothing at all? I must apologize if I have upset you. I didn't mean to. I'm truly very sorry. Oh, now she's getting like an attitude. Is it true that there's a United States Marshal aboard this flight? Why would you ask such a thing? I heard some of the other crew talking. <laughs> Let's hope she buys that. I have no idea. No idea at all? Isn't the passenger list burned into your memory? Even if I did know, I couldn't tell you. Why would you care to know, may I ask? Oh, just a passing interest. It's a hobby. Um, let's see. Oh, look, there's a phone right here. There's no signal. We're all gonna die. Okay, um, for this exit. This emergency door is sealed up tight. Just where does the courier plan on making his escape from? Pretty sure it's supposed to be tight, sir. 